Florida in North America, where a gentle giant faces daily danger. Every winter, Florida manatees gather in huge numbers along the densely populated coast of America's Sunshine State. These large aquatic mammals are distantly related to elephants and can weigh up to half a ton. They're attracted here by the warmth of naturally occurring hot springs. But in these crowded waterways, they are at constant risk. Many bear the scars of traumatic encounters. For decades, boat strikes have been a leading cause of manatee deaths. As mammals, manatees must frequently come to the surface to breathe air. But despite growing up to four meters in length, they are difficult to spot from above the water. During the last century, as the human population of Florida grew and boat traffic increased, the manatee population began to fall. By the 1990s, only around a thousand remained. It seemed they might disappear forever from American waters. But faced with the loss of these much-loved neighbors, many in Florida were determined to take action. Strict speed limits with heavy fines were imposed safe zones created. And the health and well-being of the remaining manatees was constantly monitored and assessed. Twenty years later, these simple measures have been remarkably effective. The Florida manatee population has increased from 1,000 to over 8,000. And for the first time in 50 years, they are no longer classified as an endangered animal. The turnaround in fortunes has brought benefits for both the manatees and the people of Florida. Thousands of tourists now visit the state to see and swim with these gentle giants, contributing millions of dollars to the local economy. This new industry is carefully managed and regulated to prevent any harmful impact on the manatees or their environment. Balancing our needs with those of the wildlife we share our planet with isn't always easy but the recovery of the Florida manatees demonstrates that the rewards from doing so can lead to a better future for all of us. <laughs>